All right, we got ourselves the teaser for the next one. It's going to be Edgar Family Air Gregor and Withering Heights Butler Faust. Faust came really, really quick, huh? Right, with Faust having a two-star ID, it's possible that maybe Catherine will go to someone else. Don't really know who yet. But anyway, let's just continue. Limbus Company. One two. One two. One two three four five. No way. There's no way that was five. Hold on. Hmm? Two. Where does it start? Two, three, four, five. Unless the double kick thing was like one move. I think the double kick might have been one move. Too soon. The double kick is here. Yeah. One, two. One. I think that's two. Yeah. Three, four. Okay. Yeah. The double kick is actually just one move. I here to join the hunt for that bastard as well. One, one, two, one, two, three. Oh shit, this art is like insane though. Man, that art for Gregor is like, god damn, dude. What is this? Is that the Edgar family butlers behind him? What's going on? Edgar family. Holy shit, this guy is crazy. And Faust is also crazy. Is this Heathcliff's shadow? Might be over might be overthinking. Okay, this one looks like blunt. And obviously he he uh, uh, Gregor's gonna be slashing, I think. Edgar family heir. That means we'll get uh we'll get the other heirs as well. So we'll get Lyndon and the brother as well, uh, the brother of Kathy, as actual IDs. So it's going to be the whole Woodering gang. And then we also have the Woodering Heights butler Faust. I'm guessing the Faust is going to be also like Otis and it's going to be a blunt sinking support. Perhaps something that either applies count or applies potency for sinking. Not sure what archetype she's going to be specifically. I mean, what part she's going to play in the uh, sinking archetype. Uh, huh. Edgar family heir. What could you be? Have you seen the manor yourself? Are you here to join the hunt for that bastard as well? What bastard is he talking about? Is he talking about Heath? Have you seen that manner yourself? Blah blah blah. Inspires nothing but despair. What is he cooking? Okay, I really have no clue what this archetype is gonna be for this Heathcliff. Hey, sorry, not Heathcliff, Gregor. I keep I keep saying Heathcliff because this is his canto. Oh man, this but the design though is like so sick. Look at that. Like lighting. Crossing the eye there. Whoa. So sick. Damn, this art is like amazing, dude. Holy shit. And of course, Butler uh, Butler Faust. Really, really dapper as well. I really like this art. Uh, the bloody art, not a fan of, not gonna lie. Not a big fan of this one. But the, the clean one though, the clean one is really, really good. I really love this art. Oh man, this Gregor is so sick. Maybe it's to pair with his uh recent wow ego, perhaps, this Gregor ID. Because he is the first Gregor tree star that we get shortly after his ego, right? It's possible that he is going to be meant to be paired with the Garden of Thorns Gregor ego. Hmm. Well, any other interesting comments? It's Sank Gregor. Holy shit, they made him real. Well, well, uh-huh. 
anything interesting. Doesn't look like it, I think. It's just people praising the art. 443 Association releasing on 4th of April. Well, Verda can continue to continue to cope, I think, because this is definitely not going to be a she ID. Oh man, I really wonder what this character is actually going to be. I really, really wonder. Okay. Yeah. Uh feel free to comment down what theories you got. Maybe there's some lore stuff that we can link to what he will actually do, perhaps. Don't really know. But I don't think he'll be sinking related. Yeah, it doesn't feel right for him to be sinking. I noticed there's a lot of blood splatter as well, but I think some people have said like if you're like blood splatters are like kind of normal in Limbus, so it doesn't particularly mean that he's gonna be a bleeding ID. But if he is going to be paired with the Rose Ego, it's possible that he's going to be a Lust uh, Bleeding ID 3 star. And that would be actually very helpful. If he has like a massive like Lust Encounter or some shenanigan like that, I think that is actually super, super good for the future of Bleed. Yep. Alright, anyway, that's really all I can kind of guess right now. Uh, not really a lot of other details to talk about here. Alright, so that's it for this video guys. Thanks for watching and goodbye. I'll see you guys when the actual kits drop. Bye-bye.